got new blinds. I love this. These are so nice. Mm. <laughs> Hey guys and welcome back. It has been like four weeks since I filmed a video and like three and a half weeks since I posted a video. So if you're still here, thank you so much for sticking with me. If this is your first time or if this is not your first time seeing my face and you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing. I'm not trying to get to three years on this platform without a thousand subscribers. That is the goal for the new year. Anyways, I just finished my first externship out in Florida. I absolutely loved every part of it. It taught me things that I never even knew that I needed to fine tune and um, get a better understanding of. I feel like it, it put me in a good place for my next externships. I will be starting my second externship come Monday and it is in low vision. I am very excited. I had a friend that was in low vision like the semester before and she absolutely loved it. So I am very excited. Last semester, I kind of struggled a little bit with getting into a routine and I definitely want to do that a little differently this semester. I already did my big, huge grocery haul for um, this week. Uh, why are these so big? Like, look at this. This is ridiculous. Literally put jerk seasoning on everything. So we're gonna get, what's this one? Mild. I like this one, I think. I think this is the one that I actually like. So we're gonna get this. And just a few things at good old Target. So it looks like they have the pumpkin flavor. Usually you get the blueberry. It's almost fall. I don't know why, but I've been being a little awkward on camera. Honestly, it's probably because I haven't been filming anything for the past like four weeks. Anyways, grocery haul. Chicken, ground turkey, honey, creamy tomato soup. I use this with the ground turkey instead of like tomato paste or marinara sauce. Broccoli, green onions, avocado, potato, mandarins, cinnamon. A huge thing of tomatoes because using this, I wanna make like a shrimp sausage dish and I want there to be gravy. So using tomatoes always made an extra amount of gravy. And then these are the sausages that I was talking about, the hot Italian sausages. <laughs> sausages sweet potatoes i want to make sweet potato nachos sometimes sometime this week kale asparagus these yogurts right here they are so good like i don't typically like fruit yogurt because i don't like the big old pieces of actual fruit in them but this is a blended greek yogurt and it is so good this has 15 grams of protein you guys know i'm always trying to get my protein in my favorite creamer ever and then we got greek yogurt this one i use more so that's like a snack this one I use more so as like a replacement for sour cream because it actually has protein content and it tastes the exact same. Shrimp, salsa for the sweet potato nachos that I'm gonna make. Kodiak cakes, so this one is the pancake flavor, or sorry, the pump, the pancake flavor of pan, okay. This is the uh, pumpkin flavor. So I believe it's just because, you know, fall is coming around. Black beans, those are also for the sweet potato nachos. Eggs. I just want to get back into the routine that I had before I left and you know get into some really healthy habits the, the year is almost ending and I don't know anyways so I'm all dressed ready to go it is literally like 6 40 at this point we need to go and run a few errands okay so that suitcase is always gonna be there I have no more space for all my suitcases so we're just gonna ignore that I have some bags here that I'm gonna bring to a thrift shop and see if I can give some of it away because I need to minimize a lot and so um, a lot of the stuff I don't wear some of it is new some of it still has the tags on it but not many there's not very many pieces like that it's so nice to be back I'm not gonna lie okay so ignore the suitcases however I bought this dress like I think a year ago and I'm literally just wearing it right now this is the only time that I've worn it and I actually really like how it fits a place is kind of cool like they're run by like young adults so they only take like more current pieces so we're gonna see how much of these clothes are gonna take i'm all sweaty i'm all hot and i'm really really hungry hungry okay english i'm really hungry so we're gonna go get something to eat and then continue on with this night because it's already like seven o'clock
guys so it is a few days later we were on our way back from new york to philly and we're driving and we see this beautiful skyline of new york from what i'm pretty sure is new jersey but there's like a west new york city on this side so i'm not exactly sure how that works um there's a little like sandwich shop up the whoops <laughs> there's a little sandwich shop up the street we're gonna walk down this beautiful path and take in the beautiful skyline today's sunday i have clinic tomorrow but it is only orientation i might have to meal prep tomorrow it's already like three o'clock so i don't exactly have like a lot of time to get home and like meal prep and all that kind of stuff and i still have a bunch of documents and stuff that i need to fill out for this semester as well so we might just meal prep tomorrow i'm gonna do a bunch of other things to prepare for tomorrow but we're just gonna you know just slow down take a few minutes enjoy the little skyline maybe get a little sandwich i already have my coffee here same order as always um but yeah and you guys are gonna come with obviously so let's go guys this view I kid you guys not like the phone is just not doing this view justice this view is breathtaking like honestly i almost forget that i have a clinic tomorrow I look rough. <laughs> we actually ended up going to a little. I can't even say that. I I'll put the name of it on the screen. But we went to a Brazilian place for early dinner. But there was like, it was so much food to the point that we have leftovers, and this is going to be dinner. So I don't have to worry about meal prep. Honestly, it's it, it's a lot of food. The place is very small, but it's so cute and the food was chef's kiss it was so 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 good okay guys so i am home now i pulled up the forms that i need to do i'm assuming by tomorrow because we start we have our orientation tomorrow like i've been saying um and the, the orientation is supposed to look, like go all day am i looking forward to that no just because i know that like i have a hard time staying up like through really long talks and i'm assuming that's what they're gonna be doing is talking so i need to sign all these while i was leaving today i'm just downloading the forms right now but when i was leaving on saturday morning you know for the brunch that i was going to i I, I do this every single time it's in those moments that i'm getting ready that i realize that I don't have anything to wear out. And this happens all the time, but no matter when I go, like no matter what, whenever I go shopping, I don't buy the right things. I just threw out a bunch of clothes on my bed that I have to now put away. And then all the stuff that I brought with me this past weekend, I need to unpack all of that stuff, all my skincare, all of my makeup. So very chill night, which is funny because I originally planned for today to be a very busy day. I was gonna film a video. I was going to meal prep. I was gonna prep my equipment, but because I have orientation tomorrow, I'm just not in, in, in the same rush. I'd rather just spend like the last night that I have of this break just relaxing. But I've been babbling for like five minutes straight, so I'm gonna fill out these forms. Somehow I forgot to end this vlog. Please bear with me, but if this is not your first time seeing my face, thank you so much for watching all the way through. I really do appreciate it. Make sure to hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. And until next time, guys, stay hydrated, stay motivated. Mind your business. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.